I'm sure that most of us at some point in our lives have dreamt of becoming a movie actor or director. Now for most, that's just a fleeting thought. Thank you, thank you, yes, thank you. But for others, the art of making movies becomes an all-consuming passion. Hi, I'm Brad Sussman, Cleveland television weather guy. But even though I'm in the business, I have as much interest in the art of filmmaking as the next guy. Come on, the butler did it, it's obvious. Yeah, come on, man, sit down. Come on, anybody can see. The big question for people like us is, how do they do it? How do they really make a movie? Now, sure, there are behind-the-scenes documentaries on DVDs and even director's commentaries. The motivation for this scene comes from the great Lithuanian actors of our day. But let's face it, there's no way we're going to get access to million-dollar budgets and massive casts and crew, so wouldn't it be great if we could have someone show us, with only local resources, how to produce a Hollywood-caliber movie on a budget of next to nothing? That's what this program is all about. We'll have the opportunity to not only hear from the filmmakers, but okay. to actually... Oh, are we rolling? But actually see them at work as they produce a top quality movie on a budget of next to nothing. Now if you haven't already done so, you might want to have a look at the movie and then join us afterwards as we see how the filmmakers made the movie time and again and how you can make a Hollywood caliber movie on a budget of next to nothing. The scene in Bobby Jones where Bobby actually looks down into the basement window and sees him to his father's workshop is a huge cheat. <laughs> okay, the house that we shot, it didn't have any basement windows. So what we did is we went down to a house a couple doors down and they had a garage door that had a really neat looking window in it. So what we did is we literally put a, a piece of plywood up, built up on saw horses, and we built a fake ground on top of this piece of plywood so that Bobby would actually, when he was sitting on top of his plywood, could look down. Hey, Bobby. Bobby Jones, scene 16L, take two. Thank you. And, action. Are you all right? Man, you all right? Go. 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 I'm going to run into you a lot more than I the next sequence here involved a Wanda in the kitchen burning up lunch before she served it to Bobby. And of course it wasn't practical to shoot uh, real flames, it was too dangerous and we didn't have the means by which to do it, so we decided to add the fire digitally. So here's some stock imagery of some torch fire that we used. 